Because you know mental health is at the top of everyone's mind and it probably is impacting your child, although they might not be able to communicate that like an adult would. So here are three ways a Texas children's psychologist says you can address mental health and school safety concerns with your child. Going back to school, Dr. Katherine Gallagher says your children may know more than you think they do about school safety concerns and stress. Her advice is to first notice and manage your own feelings. Sometimes we're so busy taking care of everyone, we don't realize our own emotions until they kind of spring up unexpectedly. So during this back to school season, one thing that can be helpful is just taking a few moments to reflect on how you're feeling. She says ask open ended questions to start conversation. You don't want to make assumptions about how they're feeling like, oh, you're anxious about this, right? But you want to make sure to give them the space to share. Listen when they're sharing how they feel. Resist trying to fix it. But you want to make sure to give them the space to share. Sometimes as parents, it's totally understandable when you see your child experiencing anxiety or distress, you have this fix it urge. And you want to do something to make them feel better. But sometimes it's actually best to just say, you know, listen, say, hey, thanks for sharing that with me. You know, it's okay to feel that way. I feel like that sometimes too. We're a team. We're going to figure this out together. It models for kids that it's okay to have feelings and whatever comes up, you have faith in their ability to, to handle it. Yeah, giving them that confidence. And the number one thing that most mental health professionals will tell you is find the helpers. There are many good people in the world who never get that attention. So she says, try pointing them out to your children as often as possible. Reporting in the newsroom, I'm health reporter Haley Hernandez, KPRC 2 News.